Hi guys, it's your boy Gadgetman44 here. I was flying my LAL5 over the viaduct, come back over this way, flew over that, I was coming back towards me, electromagnetic field interference. Lost picture on my goggles, so I wanted, I knew I was in this field, so I just wanted to bring it down. Uh, it must have come down on the arm. All that's happened is it's cracked the arm. These two plates sandwich uh, the arm. So there's just two bolts there, guys. Look, two bolts. Take them off. That piece slides out. I've got a new arm at home. So uh, I won't get onto it today. I might get over onto it over the weekend or something. But it's, it's doable. I've got the tools, I can take it all to work with me. When I get five minutes at work, I can just change everything out. Just take the arm off, undo the bolts, take the arm off. I've armed it and all motors are spinning fine. So I'll do a few little test flights just to make sure there's no, you know, not making any noises, but I armed it a few minutes ago. There's my Fat Shark Recons or Reckon. Uh, that is my jumper T light with P to the penetrator for using the internal um, receiver. And I've got a modded Express LRS. This is a beta FPV 2.4. A pin snapped, so I've soldered a wire to where the pin was, and then that wire goes into the hole where the pin would slide in. And then it gets power from the radio as you can see it lights up there you go guys so video to follow that arm is snapped but yeah you know these things happen don't they guys i've been gadget man 404 i found my drone so i'm very very happy i'll catch you the next one gadget man 404 out